Hey guys, it's Kim Dao here. Welcome back to my vlog channel. Today is Easter Saturday, so things should be open. Yesterday was Good Friday, so pretty much all the stores were closed. Today we want to go and buy some furniture for our new apartment. We are after a computer desk, a couch, possibly like a small oven, maybe like a really cheap coffee table because we do plan to ship our current coffee table in Perth to Sydney but we're probably not going to do that until end of the year so yeah we're still um, trying to figure out what we are going to bring from Perth to Sydney but anyway uh, we are going to first pack a suitcase put more stuff in there and then transport it to our Airbnb and then from there we will head off to Amart, um, I don't exactly know where that is, but we are going to have to take a train out um, Probably spend the day out looking at furniture and oh grocery shopping as well got to do that All right, so I'll take you guys with us. Let's go made it to our apartment now We're just going to unpack the stuff and then head off to I think Daiso and we're gonna go to Woolworths we need to go Daiso because we need to get a tape measure to measure dimensions of the rooms just so when we buy furniture it actually fits it's just so hot in here like I mean yeah because we don't have blinds right now the sun is going into the apartment and it's just so humid in here too so actually in Daiso I hope that they have those things that you put into your closet so your clothes don't get moldy. I went into Daiso like a couple of days ago and it looks like they were pretty um, good with the stock. I'm gonna hang up all of my jackets. Some spare coat hangers here and I'm just gonna leave these ones in Sydney. So this air mattress we are actually going to move into the other room because we realized there's no way you can survive sleeping on this with the sun shining in so brightly. It's still the morning. Our blinds won't be done for another two weeks so once they're done it should be Okay, so yeah, we're gonna move all of this into this room here because there's not as much light and it feels so much more cooler in here already. So I just kind of packed away some stuff quickly into the bathroom. I mean, it's just temporary for now. Um, some of my skincare PR I received, some makeup PR, and then inside here I just put some makeup and skincare I got at the event I went to the other day. I mean for now we just leave it in there and then I'll figure out later what I will do with them. Just one will do. Just one for now? Okay. Yeah because I got more coming from. Uh, okay so we got some shampoo, my favorite coffee, and then 43 that will last me about a year and a half. <laughs> we need to buy some bed sheets and half price. <laughs> oh they're half price okay sweet. Just get like the cheapest ones yeah, yeah, because just, it's yeah I'm looking just because it's for like the air mattress, so maybe get the ten dollar ones. Yeah. Okay, so I get something like this. Yeah, get a nice grey like one. Contrast. Three dollar. Oh, it's a two pack as well. Okay, yeah. It's How like three dollars. Three bucks. Yeah. $7. This is awesome. I like this is half price. Um, no, only some of them. Only oh, this one. It's a memory one. foam pillow. I mean, like, okay, these are just temporary as well, yeah, exactly. aren't they? So, like, just get. I mean, as long as you can survive on it. I mean, half price. So normally it's like twenty-eight dollars. So that's already cheap. Yeah. So like, do you trust it? Yeah, why not? Eric just found those. No, but like these don't fit me. They're all big sizes. No, 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 no. It's okay. I don't like these ones. <laughs> get these. You get these ones. They're so like Australian. But laundry detergent. So you need dish scrubber, dish detergent. Yeah. We saved like sixty-two dollars. Pretty good. We made it back from Woolworths. So let me show you guys what we got in our very first supermarket haul. We didn't buy any food. We just got mainly like cleaning supplies. So okay. Um, first off, we got let's see. In this bag we have dishwashing detergent, sponges for the kitchen, toilet cleaner. Dishwashing sponge, pillowcase, this one was like $2 I think. Shampoo, squeegee. This one is our fitted sheet for the air mattress. Now for our sheets, we just got the cheapest one because it's just temporary. And the air mattress, we're going to keep in this apartment. So whenever friends come over and want to crash, then they can use it. It's more comfortable for them. And then we just got this printed quilt cover sheet. This was like one of the only ones they had. Um, and well, I was hoping they had just a plain one, but they didn't have any, so we just got this 
floral one, but it's only temporary once again, so we don't really care about it. We got some Jif for cleaning. Uh, in this bag, we have a, a tape measure, softener for our laundry, and laundry detergent, floor cleaner, my Blend 43 cheap coffee. Then we got a mop, toilet paper, and a memory foam pillow for Eric. It cost us $146.73, and we saved $62.80 because a lot of the stuff we bought was all half price, so we came at a good time. We'll leave that in the um, Got my Blend 43 coffee. Oh, that's my mum. Oh. Now we're going to use our measuring tape to measure um, some areas in the apartment so we can figure out what we can buy for furniture. Because we're going to put the TV here, so the couch needs to go here, but the wall finishes here, but we can't put it there because it's just awkward. Do you want me to hold? Yeah, hold it. I think. Yeah. It's about. 180. 180 for TV. Okay, let's write it down. We finally made it back to our Airbnb. Um, just getting some water because we're really thirsty. I had to pick up some stuff that I forgot earlier. And now we are going to get lunch and then we're going to head to Auburn to go to AMA and the furniture stores over there. Almost like every single place is closed today still, so <sighs> we have to put up with McDonald's again. So I just got a sausage and egg McMuffin. Eric got, what'd you get? Michigan? Yeah. We need to go to Clyde Station, which is on this yellow line. What's this? Richmond line? No, the Western line? We have made it to Clyde Station. So this is Auburn area I believe. Um, we just found out that there were a lot of furniture stores here so we thought it would be good for us to just explore this area. If we pay for everything today hopefully things might come in the next couple of weeks. So by the time I get back in Sydney I'll have a nice furnished apartment. We are at AMA and one of the main reasons why we are here is there's this buy one get one half price. We made it! This is the couch that we were looking at. It's only $800, and if we get something else as well, we can get the half price. We were thinking about getting this computer table. It's $400, so if we pair it up with the couch, it would be $200. like this. Yes. I like this, yeah. <laughs> Outdoor bed. Don't know what we'd use it for. We have decided on buying this TV cabinet, and then we are getting this cabinet area as well so we are hoping to put like our shoes in here these drawers are just for storage like you know medicine keys and stuff like that pretty happy with our progress today like we bought four furniture items the sofa the computer table the TV cabinet and the drawers and all together including delivery it was all like 1700 because of the sale that's going on so I'm super happy about that now that we are still in this area we're gonna go walk um, around so I think we might stop by the good guys see if we can find a small oven um, otherwise yeah I think we are almost done with our furniture shopping. Successful day. More furniture shopping. I don't think we are going to get a table for our apartment. It's just not enough room. This dish is kind of unique. Oh, lights. Oh, I want smart globes. You can try and get them yeah, on Amazon. Those, yeah, we will be able to change them in this apartment as well. Nice. These are awesome for filming, so I might grab some of these later. But I'll get them on Tarba. <laughs> Oh, these are fancy measuring cups. Look at the price of these. The spoons, they're $40. All right, we're gonna get this oven. Let's go, Eric. We had decided to take the bus back to the station because we've got this big over bus so we don't have to carry it. It's quite a long walk. It's like a 20 minute walk to the station. And there's a cast to go. We have to go sometime. So Eric got some pho and I got bun bò hue. Apparently to 
drink it, you what? Stir it nine times to enjoy a lighter taste. Oh, so it's really warm at the bottom. Yeah. Warm at the bottom or cold up here. Okay. So you don't mix it, it's just... Mmm! Oh wow! That's so sweet! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Nine. Okay. It's a lot better. A bit lighter. A lot better. Hey guys, it is the next day. I am now in my new apartment. I just spent the whole morning packing my suitcase and moving everything over here. I am leaving Sydney tonight at around 8 p.m. So, I mean, it's only 11 a.m. right now, so we've got a lot of time. Uh, the plan today is to catch up with some friends for the last time because I will be away for about a month. I also want to go to Daiso to have a look at some of the homeware stuff because I know it's really cheap. It's like $2.80 per piece i mean not as cheap as japan but still cheap for australian standards so hopefully we'll have some time to go down to daiso i'm gonna pick up some stuff I'm gonna also vlog it for you guys and yeah that's it i'm gonna go down and grab my friend now because they're waiting Darling Harbour, we're gonna get pancakes on the rocks for lunch. I'm excited, I haven't had this in years. I used to go to the one in Northbridge in Perth, but it closed down a couple of years ago. So, I was really sad when it closed down, it was one of my favorite places. Okay, my favorite was like this one, I think. Yeah, it was that one there. And I loved the blueberry one, blueberry heaven. So I'm going to get the chicken and mushroom and then Eric and I are going to share the black forest cherry. At Woolworths again, doing some grocery shopping. Buying one of these bags and then just some Voss water bottles. You can reuse them again. Basket? Yeah, let's get a basket. Eric. Oh, is that the one? Yeah. Spicy noodle challenge. Two times spicy. They got the heart pocky, it's a heart shape. These are all two dollars eighty each. I don't need any of the kitchen stuff. Chopping boards, knives. These are like my favorite. <laughs> I love these so much. Those Have you guys tried these? What's that? This is amazing for Matthew cleaning up. It? Yeah, for cleaning up. Uh -huh. Like it just gets rid of everything. All the grime and the sink that builds up. Yeah. Uh -huh. Like you just. gently and just all comes off. Yeah, it comes off. Like it's magic. Wow. It's amazing. You definitely should get this. Oh, you can get a massive one if yeah. you want. This is a vacuum seal bag. This is different. These vacuum seal bags. Oh, this one you actually have to put a yeah, vacuum in there. Oh, there's these ones down here. Cupboard, the plain ones. Yeah. Just get some of those. Which ones? I use those ones. I like them a bit better. Embossed ones. Yeah, yeah, they're better. Yeah, okay. We'll get some of that. Oh. Yeah, get one for now. We need some of this. What's that? This is a dehumidifier, which you do, trust me. Could you just dump it in your closet? You need this one too. I love these little storage containers. I remembered I bought a bunch of them in Muji first and then I found out that they were cheaper in Daiso. Hey guys, I am back in my apartment. Ugh, 
I'm so tired. We walked around so much today. I feel like, okay, the good thing about being in Sydney is that I walk around a lot more. When I'm in Perth, I get so lazy. I drive everywhere. So it's good that I get more exercise here. For now, I'm just going to rest in the apartment. It is currently 10 past 4 p.m. My flight's around 8 p.m. So I got a lot of time. I'm planning to take an Uber to the airport around 6 p.m. So I've got... I don't know, another two hours to kill. I'm planning on going to my parents' house tonight to sleep over just because I really want to play Vuki. Then maybe the next day I might head to my own apartment in Perth. Just before I pack my bags, I'm going to show you guys what I got at Daiso today. I got these dehumidifiers which you put inside your closet. I've also got this one as well. This one you just hang up. Got two of the fire ramen noodles. I really want to do the fire ramen noodle challenge with Eric, so I'll do it when I get back to Sydney because I don't have time this time around, unfortunately. I'm going to put these in my closet now, and then I'm going to pack my bag um, and head to the airport soon. I'm just going to hang this up actually, maybe in the middle, so just right there. And then, there's a seal, you just remove that, and then there's this like fabric on top. Just be careful not to break that. Let's put this on the floor. Yeah. I'm going to do the same to Eric's room. guys, I am in my apartment in Perth and I originally was going to spend this time to catch up with you guys but I am dying. It is like 12 p.m. right now. I just had lunch but I haven't had my coffee yet so I just can't concentrate. I can't think. So I have decided to head out. I'm gonna go down to the local shopping center because well I have a few errands to run. I need to pick up some parcels at the post office that I missed. Perth opened up a Daiso finally a couple of months ago and I haven't had a chance to go yet. There are a few things I need to buy for a video so let's go. Hey guys, so an update. Um, I picked up my packages, I got my coffee, and I'm now at Westfield Carousel. Though, okay, I'm not gonna lie, I spent about two hours Pokemon hunting because I really wanted Shiny Buneri and I couldn't get it. I just gave up. I was just like, I'm so done. I need to get my errands done before the shops close, so whatever. I mean, you get lucky days and unlucky days. Yesterday, I actually got a Shiny Machop and Sunken, so maybe I just used up all my luck. Um, anyway, let's go inside now to Daiso. I'm gonna finish drinking my coffee too. I found a Daiso. Wow, it's pretty big. I have finished with my shopping and I bought so much stuff from Daiso. You guys might be like, why are you buying so much stuff in Daiso when you are leaving Perth anyway? And that's because I have a video that I am currently filming. Oh, it's taking me so long to film. I think I've spent about six months on it already, but I just feel like something is missing and I needed to go back to Daiso to buy some more things for the video. Anyway, um, it is like five o'clock now, so I'm going to drive home in peak hour traffic. Hey guys, I am back home in my apartment and um, I guess some bad news. I don't feel too good. I think I am actually getting sick. So for the whole day, my nose was runny. Um, I've been feeling really tight, even though I had my coffee. 
I still felt tired. Between Perth and Sydney, there is a two hour time difference right now. I've been kind of sleeping late, but then waking up really early. So I don't think I've been getting enough sleep. Also, there's kind of like a change in weather because Sydney was a lot warmer. Perth has gotten really cold. I think I've come down with a cold, so I apologize if I'm sniffling a lot. I am going to go to my parents after this. So I'm gonna take some medicine and then go bouldering afterwards. Actually, I don't think I should go bouldering because I am a little tired but I really want to see my friends and my cousins going as well so I'm gonna try and make an effort to go maybe I won't climb as much but anyway I want to show you guys what I got today in my packages so I picked up a couple packages that I missed when I was away in Sydney so this one is from my agency Max Connectors oh my god oh yes I got a bunch of Fenty Beauty products oh my gosh I am in love with Fenty Beauty like everything they come out with is just amazing so I got a bunch of their bronzers um I also have oh, highlight as well oh, wow wow guys I got three of the Sun Stalker Instant Warmth bronzers and then I got two highlighters um one is the Killer Watt Freestyle Highlighter Duo and I got the Killer What Fuel Freestyle Highlighter. I got some contouring brushes. Oh, I'm so excited to try this. And then this one here is a highlighter brush. Ooh. Thank you so much Fenty Beauty. I am so excited. I cannot wait to try those out. RawCosmetics.com So, oh my gosh. From Raw, I got the Superfood Infused Beauty Relax Me Rollerball. And then this one is a Mood Mist Body and Vibes. Oh, perfect. The Relax Me Pure Essential Oil Blend. The Relax Me Body Oil. From Raw, they gave me the Aroma Diffuser Ultrasonic. So it's an air humidifier and purifier. This stuff, this is amazing. That looks beautiful. This would actually match my apartment in Sydney. So I'm gonna bring this all the way to Sydney with me. Thank you so much, Raw. That's amazing. I'm definitely going to be using this and I can't wait. I also got some YesStar packages, but I'm not gonna show you guys in this video because it's gonna be on my main channel. I then went to Daiso and I picked up a lot of items actually. So I went in and tried to find some products that were interesting and stuff I haven't really tried out yet. I just broke my nail, I realized. <laughs> That's okay, I have to cut them anyway for bouldering. I got this shoe deodorizer so your shoes don't stay stanky. <laughs> then I got this sponge holder that you put on your sink in the kitchen. I thought this one was so cute, it's like an echidna. Razors for my eyebrows, and I've mentioned this many times before, but I'm really bad with doing eyebrows, but I think I've improved a lot. So when I went to Korea, um, I got my brows redone, and what they did was pretty much shave a lot of my hairs off, because I have very, very thick brows. And I think that really helped, because now I can shape my brows however I want. So that's why I got some brow razors. I got some colorful ice cubes. This hook where you can clip on, I guess, a broom or a mop. This super absorbing mat. Cutting board sheet. Toothpaste squeezer. A clothing brush. Dehumidifiers for the closet. Yoderizer for the fridge. A door hook. Hanger clips and a hair cleaning sponge. That is all the stuff I got in Daiso. It's quite a lot actually. But um, yeah, I got this really cool video planned. I don't know when it will be done, probably like in a couple months time, but I'll do my best to get the filming on the way whilst I am in Perth. I was going to spend some time to talk to you guys and just kind of let you know how I feel about moving to Sydney and coming back to Perth, but I think I might save that for next time because I just feel like this video is going to be like an hour long. I'm gonna take a few days off vlogging because I am so behind on work, I have so much to catch up on, so I'm gonna spend the next few days and work really hard to get everything done. I'm in Perth for two weeks and I think I'm only going to make two videos. So I might go back to weekly vlogs because by the time I upload everything, I would be back in real time again, I think. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.